Regan Saymaker for International Boxing News. And I have the pleasure to be joined by still WBC International Champion Ryan Garner. Ryan, great performance against undefeated Archie Sharp in there. How was that? Mate, I'm buzzing. Loads of things I could have done better. But, mate, I've just uh, beat a 25 and 0 number, f number 3 with the WBO. It don't get any sweet in that. That's a massive step up for me. Do you know what I mean? Archie Sharp, like he said before in interviews, he was due to fight people like Navarati, Shakur Stevenson. So to, to get that scalp. It was a good fight, Archie's a good fighter. I, I like him a lot, mate. He's a good man. There was no, there was no malice in there. Do you know what I mean? Good, good person. It was just obviously strictly business, but mate, I'm buzzing. You know what I mean? Buzzing. Definitely. I mean, career best performance from yourself, obviously. Right. You, mu you must, be, you must be targeting those names that Archie's been mentioning with that rank, high ranking that he's had. Yeah, obviously he's free with the WBO. So I'll see what's next, mate. I don't know what, how the rankings work, who goes where after or you win, but I'm 16 and 0 now, mate. Um, just beat a 25 and 0 and I'm a free with the WBO so the sky's the limit now mate I'm just like I said I got my daughter being born in October I've just had two cats back to back I might have a little break now have the birth of her and then um, hopefully Frank can get something down the south coast at the end of the year for me definitely mate congratulations on that news as well it was great great to hear I mean what would it mean to you to have that fight in the, uh, in the south coast it must be mega for yourself uh, mate it's massive uh, me and my trainer Wayne we've been shouting about it on every interview since um, we want something in the South Coast. Obviously, St Mary's would be ideal, but now the season's starting. It, it, just whatever, if oh, they got um, BIC down in Bournemouth, that's still South Coast, not very far, so we'll see what happens, mate. Definitely as well. Obviously, it's fair to say you've gone from strength to strength this year. This has probably been your most active calendar year. I mean, want to carry that on, obviously, with a little break, but want to carry that on towards the back end as well. Yeah, like you say, um, this, <laughs> mate, this most active will be for a little while. Like, I had my last fight. I had two weeks off, went on holiday, straight back in the camp for this fight. No, even with cuts and that, Jimmy, it didn't stop me from the last fight. Straight back in there, Archie was up. <laughs> it's a bit of a, uh, a bit of, bit of a laugh, really. Obviously, Archie kept mentioning the whole uh, build-up about the cuts, all them cuts, and he got cut. You know what I mean? So, a bit of karma there. But listen, I love Archie a lot. We got along really well. He's a family man. I'm a family man. Nothing against him. That was a good fight, and I got a lot of respect for him. Do you know what I mean? So. It's, a, it's all a laugh, isn't it? Definitely, Ryan. I know you've got to see the doctors. Any final words for your fans who come to the O2 tonight? Listen, mate, you heard him. My numbers are slowly creeping up. And I'm sure Frank, I'll speak to him. We want to fight down the south coast of Southampton, mate. Definitely. I look forward to having my holiday down the south coast. Ryan Garner, thank you very much. Cheers, mate.